Hello, my name is Karak32, and welcome back to our Greg Tech New Horizons Season 2. I am actually was just over, I'm crafting up some uh, more space assemblers, and I was actually just looking at these multi-blocks, and I was kind of curious why certain ones were turning on, and I actually have no idea how they are programmed, to be honest. Uh, like all the the buffers are on this one, I've done the top right one on most of them. You can kind of see that's where all our our recipes are. Uh, but for some reason, like this one seemed to be the one that was turning on first, which I just thought that was kind of curious. I don't know. I have no idea how it picks. Is it completely random? I actually don't know. Um, a couple of these were running like permanently, but this one seemed to be whenever like a new a uh, new thing went in. Uh, see now that one's already on. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like it seems like over here are the first ones to turn on. Anyway, I just thought that was kind of interesting. I have no idea how those uh, how it chooses to do that. Um, but last episode, we did go ahead and set up our space assembler or a space elevator. And I'm going to install uh, these modules in each of them. Um, I am just crafting like uh, a few at a time because then I'll use the. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter. I was thinking like we would probably use the the new assemblers in the recipes to craft up more of them, but uh, I'm thinking we actually, I don't think we actually need that many circuits. These are mainly um, circuits that we need to craft up. And I think... How do we want to probably only underneath actually now that I'm thinking about it that would probably be like the cleanest looking yeah if I really wanted to I mean it doesn't really matter I'm just I like having the things look as clean as possible Especially because that one I never, I never really bothered with it. But uh, if we do, I don't know. I'm just kind of throwing stuff down. Yeah, and then, I mean, it, like I said, it really doesn't matter how good this looks. But uh, I think it, it might actually be easier. We just do it all out the bottom. Now, there's going to be 24. So, you know what we'll probably do is what I'm thinking. Why don't we do like that? Yeah. Also, why is that not? That might just be... Oh, we need more cables. Uh, that might just be not warming until I turn it on. Yeah, there it goes. Sometimes they just take a while. All right. Like that. And then I will probably send this one. Wait a second. Where am I? No, that's the... Yeah, we'll do that. Um, I might actually... Oops. Maybe I'll connect... I don't technically need wireless, to be honest. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, I could just run cable aid. It doesn't, it doesn't really need to be wireless. 
they'll be yeah instead of doing that change plan let's just all run it to one i might have lost a couple there because i need to unfortunately i need to hold shift when i'm breaking them Yeah, if we just send them all in there. We're only going to have 24 channels total on the side, so. Now oh, that one didn't. All right. Oh, that's not where I wanted that, is it? All right. Oops. We'll just do this. This really doesn't. It doesn't matter what this looks like, as long as it's connected. I mean, I could do wire wireless from every single one of these, just to the main base and stuff, but... Uh, Alright, yeah, I kind of like that. And then, if we... Kind of fill in... Maybe I'll just... Maybe I'll do this. Did that look weird? That might look weird. Actually, I kind of like that. I know technically that's higher up than the... Like, if I did a platform, but... I actually think that looks good. Yeah, I think it looks better than that, actually. I could do a different, I could do like a different block too. It doesn't have to be stone bricks, but all right. Well, anyway, you can see like how long it takes just to try to make stuff nice, <laughs> which is why I usually have a tendency to just say screw it and not spend a whole bunch of time on it. Yeah, I think we'll, I think I'll do that. Plus it makes it a bit easier to run cabling. Now, we got space assemblers. Yeah. Oh, this also reminds me, there's one over here that needs to be replaced and I never have. Alright, that should switch over. Sometimes it just takes a second to sort itself out. I kind of, I really kind of wish we had... We have, I may actually just turn that into a pump just so that I don't, I don't know. Something like having three pumps and one or two pumps and one assembler kind of bugs me, uh, but that's just me being silly. And plus it, ooh, I just uh, broke that and realized if I didn't have another one to replace it, it would have uh, shut the space elevator off. I don't. I was like, yeah, I don't think that that's not hydrogen. Yeah, we have the one. We have the one minor. Maybe I'll, you know what, maybe I'll, oh, I don't feel like moving the miner, do I? This is me just being silly, to be honest. Like, nothing about this matters at all. Uh, I just need to get everything. Oh, I forgot to put the things on there, too. I gotta remember to do that. And 
in the output. All right. Well, I'll continue to do this and get these all hooked up and running. I was like, where did the... There you go. Uh-oh. What did I do? Incomplete structure. Did I screw that up by putting... like output buses without putting the modules in did that screw that up maybe i don't i don't think placing blocks were they don't need. I don't think that would screw that up, would it? All right. How did I break the? Where is it? I don't see. All I did was place the the two. Is that screwing that up? Hold on. Hold on. Two. I heard something in place. Alright. I have no idea where that went, but I heard it place. Did I have... I must have had a... I must have had a missing block and I, I didn't see it. Hmm. Yeah, it must have, there must have been a missing block somewhere and I just didn't notice. Okay, anyway, that was a bit funny. So, how many more of these do we need? Uh, we need... I have one there, that is the two. Alright, so this has 24 modules. The whole thing has 24 modules. Six on each side. And then I have seven. So I need 17 more. And I think, I think we're good over on this one too. All right, so we need 17 more. Man, I remember when these were super expensive to craft up just one of them felt like crazy um i'm pretty sure this is using quite a few yeah you can see there's quite a lot of motors and stuff um 872 of those curious where how much universium is it yeah 3479 blocks of universium for the the nanites well only 31,000 Universium. Then we have 800,000. Although that has dropped quite a bit. Weren't we up over a million at one point? So, yeah. It does... Uh, you do use it up by crafting up these things. So, Oh, I know. Because I've actually crafted up. Uh, it wasn't just space assemblers. I actually have crafted up yet a, another whole seven block. So that's where a lot of the Universium went in, crafting up the uh, the Stargate parts. All right. Also, I need to finish doing this. I know it doesn't look like anything super exciting. I do need to replace that with something as well. Maybe I'll do black. B. Um, I think it's black quartz. I think I did for that. But we are we are just chugging along. This is actually we're getting um I'm getting a new like Stargate block almost per episode now, aren't we? So we're up to four. And the quest is for seven. I mean I know technically I need a second one. Uh, I still haven't figured out what I want to do with that. Um but 
Okay, uh, let me continue crafting up the, or getting the space elevator thing crafted, put together. And uh, we'll come back. Okay, I have just hooked up the thing, and I think we're good. Now, I actually, when I was, I realized instead of doing the stone bricks, we could actually just use the ultra high strength concrete floor and that actually made that much much cleaner i actually really like that now i'm like looking at the other one and i'm like man i really should have uh <laughs> i could have made that so much cleaner looking but uh it doesn't matter it it's literally just cosmetic stuff but yeah also it just makes it like so much more organized too um but I did connect, I had this one over here, and uh, we just added this one, and unfortunately I didn't have any more channels over here. Uh, we're at 32 channels, this is all the, the channels going to this one, and then I get sent to the main base. Um, I did have this one over here, but for some reason I decided to connect it over here, so I was like, this is just channels under there are a nightmare whereas this is nice and clean now so this takes the three output buses and uh so this one is what sends it to the base so i think we're good here now i just need to connect all these to the original crafter uh the this one is obviously going to have more a lot more channels because it has the things connected also i'm just noticing that's not really connected because there's we don't have a channel going there hmm i wonder how long that's not <laughs> been connected uh i don't think we really use tritium anymore though do we uh we don't craft that up I don't think we craft a molten tungsten zinc plasma. Yeah, we don't. We get zinc plasma from our Eye of Harmony now. So I don't even know if we actually use that. Yeah, we have 141 billion zinc plasma. So uh, it doesn't really matter. Where am I? Over here. Yeah, this is the main one. So I just need to connect all these. And I think that is that completely set up. Also, when I was placing these down, I was just thinking, I'm like, I probably could have placed those underneath to hide those even more. Yeah, see, it just looks like, it looks a lot better. I mean, I do like how they have the way it's set up. There are like spaces so you can get cabling and stuff through here. Because um, if that was like a completely solid floor, it might make that a bit of a nightmare. Uh, but it also. Did I do? Yeah. It also makes it kind of awkward looking i think with like the holes in the floor yeah that just looks a lot a lot cleaner all right i think i did them all but i'm talking so i may have missed one i'm pretty sure we did right yeah i think we're good and they I think they're all turned on. Nope, they're not. All right, that's kind of a pain. Why are some turned on and some aren't? Who knows? All right, let's get this up. Okay, there we go. So there we go. One full space elevator dedicated just to crafting. I don't know where this is crafting. Is it sending it up to some imaginary space station? Where it's crafting this stuff up who knows i don't know what the lore behind this is but uh yeah man that looks so clean and tidy i really really like that i don't know sometimes you know you just build stuff and you're like you know what 
I did a pretty good job. And, uh, yeah, that just looks so good. And then you come over here, it's like, ah, what is this? <laughs> what is this cabling? But, all right. So that should make crafting up optical circuits quicker. Now, obviously, uh-oh. We got share bond issues. I have... It is running. We are just going through it faster than... No, it's not running. Why aren't you running? Did I never turn it back on when we had that... Oh, man. Did I not turn it back on when we had those issues with the, the power? When I accidentally let, broke my base? Oh, no. I don't even think we turned... No, we did turn those back on. All right. Well, that's a bit of an... Oh. Uh, it might just need to... All right. Why did... What just... What's going on? <laughs> the A system just decided to have a hiccup there. That was a bit funny. My base. My base is falling apart. It's falling apart before my very eyes. All right. Yeah, I don't, well, sometimes when you mess with cabling, but I wasn't messing with cabling there. That was the, the weird thing. No. All right. So, yeah, I think I accidentally... Ooh, there we go. We got 320 there. Um, I think I accidentally... I forgot to turn that back on, which... Oh yeah, we were up at like 3 million or something at some point. All right. Well, we need to let that run. But that is that's kind of the name of the game right now is just letting our base run and get more resources. We could definitely I mean, I don't particularly want to speed this up. I could speed it up a little bit. But then other parts of the process breaks, like crafting up the chronic singularities and stuff. Then I would have to craft up another uh, another one of these to keep up. So uh, I do find it easier just to let the world run. All right, what is something's going on with my A system? What have I done? Uh-oh. Yeah, what? Something is causing it to stop and redo itself. I mean, I just added some... Hmm. Yeah, look at that. Interesting. That's a bit funny, isn't it? I wonder if... I need to clean all this up, too. I connected it to that one. Is it trying to, like, send channels through, like... An hmm, that is very strange. Alright, let me, um... Let me figure this out here. Okay, yeah, I really don't know what is going on with that. Uh, I have cleaned up. Okay. Yeah, actually, we're going to do. Yeah, I think I'm going to connect this to a different one. Now, it should be, the full channel should be going, it's connected to this one right here, and now the full channels are going through it. It's connected directly to the controller, so it should just be, I don't see why there would be a bit an issue, like why would only some channels go through? 
But I'm kind of wondering if maybe I should do this. Yeah. This is almost kind of telling me I really should... Uh, I really should sort out and clean up my A system. Uh, sometimes you can see, like... When you mess with the things, it's like having to recalculate them all, and it kind of messes. Yeah, it's back on. Um, and that is just because the uh, AA system has gotten so big. But uh, that that was kind of weird. Not gonna lie, that was definitely a bit weird. Um, oh man, next episode is. Am I gonna really have to? I've talked about redoing our A system and getting it cleaned up and not so crazy. Like, this is 9 channels, this is 14 channels. They could be merged and just sent into the thing, so I don't know. Also, all these, um, I got rid of most of them. Um, as you can see, we weren't using all of them, but there are still a couple P2P um, that we are using. What's the name of this thing? Memory card. Yeah, so maybe... Where I think I want to like I don't want to accidentally cancel anything. Um, oh, these are no, I don't know. Two forty nine ninety seven ninety five. Is this on, wait, 247, is that on Mars? That might be on Mars, is why we're not seeing it. All right, uh, I think next episode, though, I think we're going to have to take a little bit of a break and <laughs> maybe sort out, like, really... Take a good look at our A system. Yeah. It's one of these. Whichever one has 32 channels. Although I don't know if... Is it that one? I think it's this one. No. 247. No, that's not... That's not it. All right. Uh, oh, here it is. I was in the right spot. There, That's the one that's going to the base. So, obviously, there's still some P2P that we need. But, um... Yeah, I do think we might need to take a look at some of our A system. I wonder if the wireless connectors are causing problems. But, uh, all right, anyway, we are chugging along here, and like I said, we got one more of the Stargate blocks. We got three more to go, at least just for that, that recipe. We are actually, I feel like we're making, like, we're making, like, a lot of power. It's probably because I've... Uh, had the world running all day without doing a whole lot of crafting. We did craft up the one block, but then uh, I basically let the world run. But uh, yeah, we are doing a decent chunk of power. I do wonder if it may be time to add some more of those astral arrays too uh, into our... This one over here, the producing universium. Uh, I just don't know how much power this is going to use if I add more. 
Maybe I'll uh, check that out as well. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. So thanks for watching and have a good one.